Good morning everyone, this is Jeannie. Welcome to my channel. I just wanted to come on real quick and say hello and you know I was going to do a haul but um but I didn't. Um yesterday I went to the grocery store. I went to Walmart and I got a few things for the kids, for my grandchildren, and it was nice to just get away and shop and browse. I did pick up <clears throat> another Sally Hansen uh, Complete Salon. I wanted red because I really love this brush. I just think a brush, I mean for your face makeup, for your nails, a brush is so important to me. And I just love this red, so I got that. Um, I got some yarn for my sister's scarf. I'm going to be making scarves forever, I think. They're so quick and easy, and they're warm. Uh, and I got some beanbag chairs for the kids, for my grandchildren, and pajamas and things. And then when I got home, I was putting everything away, and we were going to go to the mall just to get some exercise you know, slow exercise, and my husband had something that's called a TIA, and if you've never seen one of those, it's really scary. Um, it's like a little flutter of a itty bitty, bitty bitty mini stroke, and it kind of just threw me back into that scary spot of my life, and I immediately called the surgeon's office. They don't even have an answering machine. They just pick up immediately and evidently having <clears throat> the procedure he had done in his heart that can occur, but he had been coughing really violently on purpose to get all the stuff up. So, so he was fine, took his blood pressure and pulse and everything and reported it to them while they were on the phone and it didn't happen again and you know he didn't lose consciousness or anything and he knew where he was. His eyes were just fluttering. Oh, it was awful. So <clears throat> that canceled all of our plans to go out. And <laughs> He's watching Frasier. <laughs> In case you hear him laughing. Anyhow, um, my hair. I trimmed my hair myself. I just cut the ends a little bit. <clears throat> oh, so today he was fine all day yesterday and it's been almost 24 hours since that happened so he is climbing the walls he wants to get out um, can't drive yet <laughs> he just... so I am going to go to the grocery store and get some food just a little bit of stuff that I didn't get at Walmart I want to get some chicken thighs and I want to make some chicken soup because I think that will really help his chest and you know all that <clears throat> so I'm going to do that and then come home and take drive to the mall so that we can you know you can sit down on benches if he gets tired but he needs to walk get out he just needs to get out for an hour so not too much but <sighs> so after all that <laughs> kind of scared me last night but I'm fine and he's fine and I wanted to do a haul, but I just, I put everything away after that TIA happened. So, um, I just, trying to get settled, <laughs> trying to get back to normal. And I think we will get back to normal. <clears throat> it just takes a little bit of time, so, um, I really do want to get back to my videos of, organizing and um, reading scriptures and all of that but uh, right now I just want to get Christmas over with which is kind of sad you don't, you know I really planned on a different kind of a Christmas that um, turned out different <laughs> and we spent our 42nd anniversary in the hospital so we didn't do anything sit there and look at each other and hold hands you know it was nice and every the nurses 
uh, on the floor gave us cupcakes with candles on it and balloons and put a big thing outside his door that said happy 42nd anniversary. It was really nice. And you know, we we did um, these compliment cards on every nurse that we came into contact with there. I made sure that each one of them was recognized some way because they were awesome during our visit and the doctors. Um, a lot of those nurses, <clears throat> I know how it works there. If you, if a patient gives you a compliment card, it's called a share card, it goes right into their file and they're recognized throughout the whole state. And I just wanted them to have that uh, because we were so grateful for everything they had done. But one of these days I'll stop talking about the hospital. <laughs> so, I don't know when, <laughs> but soon I'll go back to normal. But I hope everyone's having a great Friday. Um, I'll come back maybe tomorrow and let you know if I was ever able to go shopping. <laughs> Take care, everyone. Have a great day today, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.